He said he's about to turn over every devil's table that's in the spirit and in the natural. Watch. Watch the overturn. Watch. Just watch. And watch the exchange. Watch the transaction. You're about to get what you've been, re- you've been you're about to get what you've been holding, holding on to because guess what? The angels of God, he said in his word, only the angels of God know how to separate the wheat from the tear. He said, come on, let them grow up together. Guess what? They're growing up together because they've been eating the same thing you've been eating. But what made them, I hear you, Holy Ghost, what made them stand out was the garment. See, the man came in and he came in for a little bit until the garment exposed him. See, when you don't got the Holy Ghost for real and when you ain't really dressed and when the angels of God come in, it's going to show who really is dressed in the Holy Ghost, in the righteousness of Jesus and who just been eating and feasting on the blessings. But there was devils. He said, I'm separating the wheat from the tear. That's why we ain't got to worry about doing nothing. All you got to do is keep standing on the word of God. You keep standing on your faith. He said, uh, making sure that if anybody asks you, you're able to give an account for the profession of your faith. Uh, men and women of God, if you have churches, uh, don't compromise. Uh, do not compromise. Don't preach a watered down gospel just because you think you're going to lose members. God said you're going to gain a great flock uh, because of the integrity and the character because you spoke those sound doctrines. Uh, according to Timothy, uh, Titus 2 and 1, speak those things uh, that begin to transform men and women into good integral character of God that begins to reflect the image of Christ Jesus uh, and not idols of devils uh, that are worshiping. He's about to tear down uh, these pedestals, these demonic altars. Y'all so help me, Jesus. The Holy Ghost is real. Jesus is real because Jesus is coming back and he's coming back for a church without spot, blemish, or wrinkle. He's getting us ready. We got to keep our garments from being spotted. Y'all, it's in the Bible.